Good evening, I'm Mike Bush. Ann Allred has the night off. Hours ago, prosecutors charged Matthew McCullough with several felony counts following yesterday's incident at a trunk or treat event at a Kirkwood school. Tonight, the St. Louis County police officer and son of former county prosecutor Bob McCullough is in jail. New tonight, our Robert Townsend has reaction from a dad who witnessed the frightening ordeal. Mike Corey Schoenhorst says initially he thought the gunfire in the school parking lot was not real, but then the Kirkwood dad says the horror of everyone running happened right before his eyes. It was supposed to be a pre-Halloween fun time for Corey Schoenhorst, his eight-year-old son, and dozens of other Tillman Elementary School families. The main crowd had just started to kind of wander in. But witnesses told police within minutes, off-duty St. Louis County Police Officer Matthew McCullough stood in the middle of a crowd in the parking lot at North Kirkwood Middle School. I held up his gun with a menacing grin on his face and a lifeless look in his eyes and and fired and waited for the crowd to react. Witnesses say McCullough fired at least five shots. Sean Horse and other moms and dads quickly grabbed their frightened children. Police say other parents tackled McCullough and held him down until officers arrived. It was just complete chaos. One kid had completely run out of his shoes. Hundreds of people were at the trunk or treat event. Charging documents reveal around 4.30 Sunday afternoon, McCullough began harassing people, aggressively approached numerous attendees and said you are all going to die. Nobody was hurt. It probably took place over the course of maybe 45 seconds, but at the time it seemed like it was eight, nine minutes. I mean, it was like time stopped. Monday, prosecutors charged McCullough with five counts of armed criminal action, four counts of first degree endangering the welfare of a child, unlawful use of a weapon, and first degree terrorist threat. The 39-year-old suspect has been a St. Louis County police officer for nearly six years. McCullough is also the son of former St. Louis County prosecutor Bob McCullough. It's a pretty scary thought because who do we turn to now for protection. In a statement, the McCullough family says in part, quote, we also are painfully aware that an incident such as this can and does cause significant trauma to those, especially children and their parents who witness such an event. Our thoughts and prayers are with those victims. While he was on the ground, he was still smiling. St. Louis County Police Chief Kenneth Gregory says McCullough is now on unpaid administrative leave pending an internal investigation. McCullough is now sitting in jail on a $500,000 cash-only bond.